all your wickedness. And it's fulfilled. Meaning, guess what? You how about shit me out shot about to make his return <laughs> and about to punch your lights out. Next scripture, 2 Edges 15 and 48. It said, Thou hast followed her that is hated in all her works. Who was that talking about? America, the great Satan. All these other nations around the world hate America. They call America the great Satan. You know what I'm saying? The whore that sitteth sit upon many waters. That's America. It said, uh, Thou hast followed her that is hated in all her works and inventions. Therefore saith God, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh I will send plagues upon thee, widowhood, poverty, famine, sword, and pestilence to waste thy house, to invade your house. <laughs> Meaning come and snatch your kids about the house, give you all type of vaccines and, and medications you don't want. It says, with destruction and death. Meaning they're not coming to shake your hand. They're coming to kick in your door and kill you, Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Next scripture, 2 Ezra 16 and 71. It said, they shall be like madmen. Well, I'm going to start... Salaki, I'm going to start at verse 70. 2 Ezra 16 and 70. For there shall be in every place and in the next city, meaning all over America, just like here in Durham, they're going to hit Raleigh, they're going to hit Cary, they're going to hit Fayetteville, they're going to hit Apex, they're going to hit Zebulon, and so forth. It said, For there shall be in every place and in the next cities a great insurrection upon those that fear the Lord, the, the Negroes, Latino, Native Americans, the elect, they shall be like madmen. Talking about these crackers. Plus these uh, NATO troops. Northcom, Africom. You know what I'm saying? Black ops. All this shit. So they're going to be like madmen, sparing none. Meaning they're going to gun us down on sight. You brothers out there that's teaching this truth, guess what? You, you on that list. They, they going to either torture you or gun you down on sight. It says, but still spoiling and destroying those. I mean, uh, yeah, but still spoiling and destroying those that fear the Lord. Talking about the elect of Israel. We the ones that fear the Lord. You know what I'm saying? Giving our lives up out there teaching them truth to try and wake up the elect of Israel. It says, for they shall waste, meaning kill. And take away their goods, <laughs> meaning your livelihoods. They can just come and take your home, take your food, take your wife, take your kids, take you. And say, and cast them out of their houses. Cast you out of your houses. Once again, going back to the article, they have the right now to just come and invade your home. If they think your children is dumb, slow, dyslexic, retarded. Whatever. The sky's the limit, just like the article said. They don't have to have a warrant. They don't have to have a... Uh, 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 they, don't, they don't have to wait on any type of government official. They just come and invade your home at any point. And it's coming to that, man. Just like the scriptures tell you about Jacob's trouble. We about to see a time, like in Daniel said, that, that we ain't never seen before, man. Never before in history, we about to go through hell, man. But guess what? Yahweh Bashim Yahushai got our back, man. Long we pray to the Heavenly Father and the Son, Yahweh Bashim Yahushai, that He keep His Spirit in us to in, to endure until the end. Guess what? He gonna help us fight, man. He gonna help us fight to lift up a standard against these punk ass crackers, man. Cause that time is coming. And it's coming soon. Like Elder Gabar, Elder Tahar, Elder Ramla, Elder Bakar, they always tell us, man, brother, stay on point because it's about to get hectic out here. This flood about to come in. You know what I'm saying? Hey, brother, stay prayed up, man. Pray, pray for each other, the elect of Israel. You know what I'm saying? You brothers in, in GMS, keep praying for one another, man. That our spirits stay lifted up to you, how about shit, how shy that we won't bug out when 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 martial martial law is implemented and these Gurkha troops come in and try and kick in your door. 
You know what I'm saying? You may have family around you. Pray that you you don't be the one that snap and, and lose c control because guess what? The family is depending on you. You know what I'm saying? So you can't afford to bug out because if you bug out, they going to bug out. They already probably going to be scared anyway and bug out. But you just got to pray that your how about shit me out with keep his spirit on, on you to keep you calm and peaceful. You know what I'm saying? That you endure until the end that you won't snap and fall out and bug out. That your mind won't go crazy. Because we about to see some shit we ain't never seen before, man. You know what I'm saying? So with that, brothers, just stay prayed up. You, you, you wicked niggas out there, you better get your mind right. You know what I'm saying? Give my all praise and glory and honor to the Heavenly Father and the Son. Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, Brakathah. Double honor to the elders of GMS that taught us this truth with all love and humbleness. Brakathah to all you brothers out there, the elect of Israel that's pushing this truth in love and sincerity. Hey, people out there, get your mind right. Return back to the Heavenly Father and the Son. Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. With that, Shalom.